hello friends today we'll see how to make windows 7 bootable disk please note that this method will not work if you are using windows xp or windows 8 so the things you will need are as below you will need a 4gb usb stick and a windows 7 setup saved anywhere on your computer as you can see here i have a 4 gb transcend usb disk which is currently connected to my laptop and a windows 7 setup folder saved on my desktop Now go to the start menu, search for CMD, right click on it and select run as administrator. This will open a command prompt in an elevated mode. Friends, now follow these simple commands. First type this part now type list disk so it will show you the list of disks which are available on your computer now how can we identify which is our USB disk so you can identify it by the size here, it, here we can see it's around 4 GB so disk 1 is our USB disk so we'll select disk 1 and we will clean it. While cleaning, please make sure you choose the correct disk because accidentally you might choose the disk 0 and you might end up cleaning your local disk. Now type the following command create partition primary now select partition first because we have choose we, we have chosen the disk one so we are now selecting the partition one and hit enter and finally type the following command active now we need to format our USB disk using NTFS so type the following command format fs equals NTFS and hit enter it will start formatting your USB disk note that it will take around 10 to 15 minutes to complete formatting
once it shows 100% completed wait for 10 to 15 seconds till it shows this part successfully formatted the volume once our usb drive is 100 percent completed type the following command assign and hit enter it will assign a new letter to our usb drive you can see the new drive letter is h which previously was g now we need to exit the disk part so type the following command exit and hit enter it will show you the message leaving disk part here you can see that the default location is c windows system 32 but we need to set the location for windows 7 folder which is saved our on our desktop so just hold down the shift key and right click of the mouse you can see the option copy as path you will get the path for our Windows 7 folder type the following command cd and paste the path hit enter now it will show you our new location now we need to use the bootset.exe file which is located into the boot folder so type the following command cd space boot and hit enter now type bootset.exe slash nt 60 space the drive letter of our USB disk that is H you can see here our USB contains the drive letter H and hit enter so it will show you the target volume will be updated and the boot code was successfully updated on all the targeted volumes So all the work for from the command prompt is done so I type the following command exit now go to the windows folder and select all file copy them go to the USB disk and paste it in here it will take around 15 to 20 minutes to copy all the files To boot from USB, 
you may need to configure your BIOS settings. So connect your USB, restart your computer and press F12 button on the keyboard. Now select the proper booting device. It will start the Windows 7 setup. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you for watching this video. If you want to find us some more shortcut methods, please visit this YouTube channel. And don't forget to press the subscribe button.